In this video, we will show you how to use the latest dollars mocap plugin and do facial capture in VAM. First, we need to download the latest version of dollars mocap main program on the dollars mocap website. We also need to download the latest version of the plugin, which can be downloaded from the dollars mocap plugin page on the VAM hub website or directly from the hub tab in VAM. If you have downloaded it yourself, please save the file in VAM's add-in packages directory. You can see a file starting with Sunny View Tech here, this is the dollars mocap plugin. After downloading the plugin, restart VAM and load a scene. Firstly, enter edit mode and click on the select icon to select our character. Make sure that we have selected person. Then add a plugin in plugins tab and choose a file. The location of the plugin file is VAM's main directory, add in packages, dollars mocap plugins.var file, custom, scripts, dot cs list file. After selecting the file, there will be a prompt asking if you want to load it. Choose allow always. Then there will be a prompt asking if you allow plugins to access network. Click OK and go to settings page. Check allow plugins network access. For convenience, you can also check other options related to plugins if desired. Now go back to plugins tab and choose reload. If you see this screen, it means that the plugin has been successfully loaded. Let's open UI and take a quick look around. This is connect button, here you can adjust smoothing parameters. This controls whether to get facial data, this controls eye tracking. The following are skeletal controls for motion capture. For more details about using motion capture, please refer to our previous videos. Now let's have a look of the facial capture in dollars mocap. You can click this button to turn facial capture on or off. Before starting facial capture, we recommend doing a calibration. Relax your face and look straight ahead during calibration. After the calibration is complete, you can start facial capture. You can adjust the strength of facial capture expressions and choose a dominant eye here. There are more detailed instructions about these on the dollars mocap website. Before starting motion capture, we need to adjust our character into T-Pose. Select Pose Presets tab, then click on Select Existing. You should be able to find Sunny Views button on the left side. After clicking it, the T-Pose included in dollars mocap plugin will appear. Choose the T-Pose, and your character will be in T-Pose. Go back to Plugins tab and click Connect. Now you can see both Facial Capture and Motion Capture are working. The strength is a bit large, let's make it smaller. During the capturing, you can enable or disable facial capture. When facial capture is enabled, you can further choose whether to track eye movement or not. After running the plugin once, you can go to saves directory under VAM's main directory. Inside there is a plugin data directory where you can find $markerlessmocap.json file. In this JSON file, you can specify the names of the morphs driven by the face capture data, and the strength. Finally, let's remember this, before connecting motion capture each time, make sure to adjust your model into T-Pose. Let's take a look at how it works.